Welcome back to JNY Cards, where we are going to be enjoying this amazing hobby together. Today is episode 301, and we're going to be opening up two blaster boxes of 2022 Heritage Baseball. Now, I recorded about maybe about four minutes of video already, and then I realized that my camera right here that I'm pointing to, my main camera, was not on. It was not recording. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I did that. And so, as you can see, I, I've already got almost everything set up, right? Both of these blaster boxes are already open. I've got the, the wrappings right here to prove it. Right here, here's the wrappings for both of the blaster boxes. I've opened one up, and its cards are right here. And I've got another one right here that still has cards in it. So I'm going to open these up. All right. Man, oh man, this box is cut up too. That's interesting. I didn't do that. Must have been the uh, the vendor who did that. Um, which happens, which happens. Um, so yeah. Normally I would have like a big old spiel about that I normally kind of go through the script that I kind of read off on, but I'll kind of quickly summarize it. You all should consider subscribing because once I hit 375 and 400 subscribers, I'm going to be giving away some stuff. At 375 subs, I've got four packs of 2021 Big League Baseball that I'm going to be giving away. And then once I hit 400 subs, I'm going to be giving away a fat pack of Series 1 and a retail pack of Heritage from 2022 and a fat pack of Heritage 2022 and a fat pack of Heritage 2021. So please subscribe. It takes like four seconds and you will automatically be entered in to win some cool stuff. That's my way of thanking my subscribers. So this is blaster box number eight and number nine of Heritage. I have not had great luck with Heritage. I think I've only pulled one Wander Franco and maybe three-ish O'Neill Cruises. And so I'm feeling it. I feel like I'm gonna hit some hot stuff out of this. I think I'm gonna, I think one of these right here, it's, it, it's a hot box. And I'm gonna be pulling a Wander and an O'Neill Cruise out of these two blaster boxes. So blaster box number eight, and number nine of 2022 Heritage. I'm excited. So um, with 2022 Heritage, it is a eight by nine product giving you 89 cards. We are looking for limited and exclusive 1973 Venezuela stamp cards. They're tough to hit. Same thing with relics and autographs, also hard to hit. Um, but each box should also come with a candy lid. I bought these for 25 bucks off of um, either at 25 ish bucks at Barnes and Noble. So oh, actually I bought them for like $22 and 50 cents because I get 10% off at Barnes and Noble. But anyways, here are the pack odds. If you want to pause and read through that, have at it, but we are going to open up these packs. All right. I feel it. I feel it. Hot box right here, right here. Nope, I was wrong. Completely wrong. Um, yeah, so let's see what we got. We got Heimer, Candelario, Patrick Wisdom, Gavin Lux, Jose Abreu, Cal Quantrill, Jake Odorizzi, Anthony Santander, Devin Williams, and Brandon Woodruff. All right. I was gonna say too, don't buy Heritage Blasters off of the secondhand market because it's easy to weigh these blasters and find a hot box, right? And hot boxes, um, they come with, in every pack of a hot box, of blaster, it, let me say that again. If you get hot box, one card, in every pack you get one purple refractor. So. Those kind of weigh a little more. So if you get an opportunity to buy Heritage Blaster boxes on the second on the second hand market, don't do it. Chances are they've been weighed and they're not hot boxes. But let's continue. Mike Miner, Ryan McMahon, 
Chris Bassett, Ramel Tapia, Brian Goodwin, and we've got Brandon Nimmo, who's doing pretty good. And our four, our high series card is Keegan Thompson. Not too bad. He's a cubby. Didi Gregorius, Dylan Cease. All right, keep going here. We've got Dustin Grineau, Ryan Jeffers, Luis Arise, Marcus Simeon, Taiwan Walker, Colton Walker rookie card, Joe Barlow, New Age Performer, Lourdes Gorio Jr., and DJ LaMahieu. All right, let's keep going. Um, so I don't have that much heritage. These are my last two heritage blasters that I have. Uh, I've got one more Heritage Mega that I'm going to open up um, maybe tomorrow. So let's see here. Jeff McNeil, Austin Meadows, James Caprillion, Cole Irving, ooh, Joel Ryan rookie card. That's not too bad. Tony Edmonds, Cedric Mullins, a World Series card, Max Kranich. Um, yeah, and then I've got one more Mega of Heritage open up, and I think that it, that's it. I, I don't know if I'm going to spend any more money on Heritage here. Trent Grisham, Mike Soroka, Josh Rojas, Matt Olson, CJ Crone, Rodolfo Castro, and behind Rodolfo is a high number of Matt Carpenter. All right. Followed by his buddy, Adam Wainwright, and Wilson Contreras. All right. So this is pack. What did I say? This is an eight by nine product. So we are on pack number six. No, seven. Sunny Gray. Dominic Smith, Max Muncy, Michael Pineda, Victor Robles, Pete Alonzo, a flashback card, um, Stolen Bases Leaders, and Vidal and Brujan. Not too bad. That might be my first Vidal Brujan. I do not remember pulling many of those. But pack number yeah, seven. Kevin. Gossman, Jared Walsh, Jorge Alfaro, Chaz McCormick, rookie card, Colin Moran, Pavin Smith, Lars Nupar, Lorenzo Kane, Shohei Otani. Not too bad. Last pack here. Let's see what we've got. All right. Steven Matz, DJ Peters, uh, Jesus Lazardo, Fernando Tatis. Kyle Seeger, Whit Mayfield, and our high number card is Cody Bellinger. That's not too bad. Logan Gilbert and Charlie and Blackman. All right, let's move on to the next blaster box here. And I can feel it. This, this pack feels heavy. This has got to be a hot box. Nope, what's wrong again? Mike Soroka, Josh Rojas, Sonny Gray, Lance McCuller Jr., Carson Kelly, Randy Arazarena. It's not too bad. And our high number is Ah oh, Williams Astudio. I love this guy. Kill Badu and then Catel Marte. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Okay. Dominic Smith, Kevin Gaussman, Josh Naylor. Ken Lee Jansen, Yoshi Tatsugo, Connor Wong, rookie. Then and now of Nolan Ryan and Robbie Ray. JT Rio Muto and Manuel Margot. Okay. We've got Jared Walsh, Jorge Alfaro, Steven Matz, Avasil Garcia, Dansby Swanson, Tyler Glasnow. Steven Strasburg, Chris Flexen, and Miguel Rojas. Okay, let's keep going here. We got DJ Peters, Jesus Lazardo again, Edmundo Sosa, Corey Dickerson, David Peralta, Matt Veerling, rookie, and then our high number is of Andy Ibanez. Very nice rookie card, too. Corbin Burns, followed by Will Smith. All right, here we go. We've got Matt Barnes, Nico Horner, Ryan Presley, Romy Gonzalez, 
rookie card, Brandon Belt, Rafael Devers, new age performers with Key Brian Hayes, that's horribly off center, Jesus Sanchez, and Sean Manea. Sean Manea, where is Sean Manea playing right now? Is he still at the A's? I don't think he is, right? I don't think he is. Comment down below, let me know where he's playing. Uh, World Series card. Tony Santolin rookie card, Dallas Keiko. 2021 rookie pitchers. Nice. Zach Plesak. Uh, World Series card with Adam Duvall. Tyler Gilbert rookie. Ooh, ooh I just saw Tampa Bay Rays. Rose Chapman followed by. Oh, darn. No wonder. Shane Bass. But Shane Bass is still pretty good too. But I would prefer a wander. We'll see. Let's see here. We got Mr. Jacob DeGrom. RBI leaders. Gavin Sheets rookie card. I'll take that. Uh, Jed Lowry. Luis Castillo. Bryce Harper. And we got Orlando Arcia. It's a high number card. Jake McGee and Jesus Aguilar. I feel it. I feel it right here. We're gonna get like a Wander Chrome card. I feel it. It's gonna be a pristine PSA gem in 10 condition. I feel it. All right, no Chromes. Dustin May, Garrett Cole, Jacob Stallings, Tiasco Hernandez. Um, what is that? Postseason card. O'Neill Cruz, there we go. Sears Tower completed, flashback card. Rookie outfielders and James McCann. All right, no wonder, but that's okay. We're gonna sleeve up these cards and we're gonna do a recap and we're gonna have a good time. I'll be right back. All right, let's do this recap here. This is my eighth and ninth blaster box of 2022 Heritage Baseball. Maybe my last ones, we'll see. Might try to get one more just so that I've opened up 10 of them and it's a nice, even number maybe I'll hit my hot box still we'll see uh, let's see uh, here's our let's see where to start I don't know I can't talk right now these are our high number cards uh, RC uh, Thompson Carpenter and Bellinger here all above 400 very nice um, our rookies are okay Matt Veerling Joe Ryan Gavin Sheets Vidal Bruhan Colton Walker Lars Nupar and Connor Wong we did not get any wanders no big deal, but we did get an O'Neill Cruz. This one's not too bad. Centering is pretty good on that. The back, unfortunately, is where these cards get dinged the most. That corner is a little white. White edging up there. This, yeah, it's tough. It is very tough to get good grades on Heritage Baseball because of the back there. So. There it is. I hope you all enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it and open up, opening up these cards as well. So I hope my enjoyment of the hobby is somewhat reciprocal or reciprocated through you as you watch me open up these cards. Um, it's late. I don't know what I'm saying. So all of you out there, please take care of yourself. And I'll see you all in the next video.